someone told me that uh, it is very easy to talk about uh, forgiveness until it is your turn to, to forgive someone. And I think they were right. We easily talk about forgiveness, forgiveness, forgiveness. But when we ourselves find ourselves in a situation where we have to forgive someone, our faith is tested, it becomes very difficult. In fact, forgiveness is not supposed to be easy. We are supposed to, to struggle to forgive. Jesus in today's gospel is talking about forgiveness. He says, I do not want to tell you that you should count how many times you forgive your brother or your sister. Not seven times, but 70 times seven. In other words, Jesus is asking us to forgive as many times as we can, as many times as possible, without keeping a record of how many times we are forgiven. And this makes it even, even more difficult. Because if someone comes to you, they wrong you, and they come for forgiveness, you forgive them, then tomorrow they, they do the same thing, then you have to forgive them again. The other day they come, they do the same thing, and you have to forgive them again. At some point, you get fatigued, you get tired. Actually, at, at that point, you don't even want to, to see them again. At that point, even forgiveness fails. This is a challenge to us Christians, especially, and it is a demand that Jesus places before us. But when we find ourselves in that situation where our faith is tested, in the sense that where we have to exercise this virtue, this value of forgiveness, we should try to forgive. It might be difficult, but, but at least we should try. And we know that for us Christians, to be able to forgive and to forgive indeed, we need grace from God. And this is our prayer today that God may give us the grace that we need for us to try and forgive so that by the help of His grace, we may actually manage to forgive. Imagine a community, a house, or a group of people in which forgiveness does not, does not actually exist. Imagine the chaos that would be there. And so it is important for us to make forgiveness a part of our life so that we may have a united community and like we have said, we cannot forgive indeed without God's grace. And we pray that indeed God may give us this grace. Amen.